I'm Amy, and I own my heritage. I have super curly hair that has a mind of its own. I don't know what my history is to be able to define what my heritage might actually be because I was adopted at seven weeks of age. My mom would do anything in the world for me, but my mom cannot help me with my hair and she never could. I have tried bazillion products. I have tried many stylists and over the years, frankly, I have gotten more assistance and guidance and support from black women and Indian women than from white women who think all hair is the same and anyone can cut anything. And they just have no idea. Sitting in a chair and seeing your hair being cut uneven is very unnerving. But what do you do? You keep looking and keep looking. I have awesome hair. I will never straighten my hair. I will never challenge my curls. I want to do everything I can to embrace the versatility, the uniqueness, and the beauty of what I have. I'm not going to pay to change me. I like me. I'm kind of cool. I'm outspoken. I'm opinionated. I'm energetic. I'm fun. I can also be annoying. And I'm okay with that because that's who I am and that's life. If I could find the perfect answer to take care of my hair or even a better answer than what I have right now, I would be a very happy woman. I want to keep my curls. I'm aging. My hair is dry. My hair is, is long. I'm not going to cut it because I'm getting older and I don't want to ignore what I have. And I'm not going to be faced with all this anti-aging nonsense that's out there today for women because that's not what life is about. Anti-aging could very simply mean dead. I'm not interested yet. I want to age. Attitude, grace, dignity, whatever other word there is besides anti. I'm not interested. I want curls and I want shine. I want bounce. I want my hair to have as much attitude as I do. I'm happy with that. Be patient. The answers will come. Don't change anything about who you are or how you live or what you do with your hair. Embrace what you have. Be who you are. There is only one you. Your hair is part of who you are. Your hair is something that you should own and enjoy and embrace. Make it what you want it to be. Whether you go for purple or no, no color changes. If you embrace your gray or you're so young that your color is just awesome as it is, curls are life's unique little fun moment that you get to have in your life every single day and you should enjoy them yourself. I found Puff Cuff, uh, I think it was on Good Morning America. Fell in love with your super bright pink bag that I use every day. I ordered the variety Puff Cuff pack. I have used uh, the Puff Cuff and I have passed on two of them to uh, friends. One is a, a young Indian woman about to become a doctor who has more hair than I do. <laughs> and she enjoyed the puff cuff as much as I have. It took a while to figure out how to use it and to, to use it right. The, um, the tutorials that are on the website are definitely helpful. Take your time and learn how to use it the right way because it will work. I'm just now starting to try some of the, uh, the hair care products. I just, they just arrived yesterday, literally. So I'm excited to, to try them on my hair. I think that uh, Puff Cuff has a great potential, seems to have great customer support. I think that it's time for everybody who has curly hair to embrace their curls and find out what works for them. And Puff Cuff is a good start.